What's good, y'all? It's your boy Cody got fire back with OnlyFuzz TV here, and I got another exclusive for y'all today. Now, a couple of days ago, uh, Fat Joe's OG Charlie Rock LD gave props, major props to Rack 100 for holding down uh, Liza Rios and Big Pun's family and all of that. Well, word got back to Rack 100, and he's not feeling it at all. He, he says that uh, Charlie Rock LD, he doesn't know who that is, and he's putting false narratives out there. Listen to what Rack 100 has to say. Tell me how y'all feel about this. Like, comment, and subscribe. We're going to keep running it up. Bro, bro. About this uh, big pun situation. Wax standing up to Fat Joe. I've never had a conversation with Fat Joe um, about big pun and business of big pun or, or nothing like that. Last time I seen Fat Joe, uh, we was at Prime 112, 25 deep, and he covered the whole bill. You know, uh, that's Game's friend. He's been my friend. Uh, shout out to Cool and Drake. So uh, all whatever was going on prior to, I wasn't privy to that to that knowledge. What I do know is Big Pun's wife came to see me, Liza, told me she was looking for a situation that would be healthy for her. Um, you know, Big Pun, I feel like it's part of the culture. Like, it's Big Pun. His story needs to be told, you know what I mean? So what I did do was line up a situation that was healthy for her, something that would happen. I reached out to my people, my team. They pushed the button and they greenlit the project. So there's definitely a big porn series coming. I just want to kill the narrative like it was some type of uh, issue with Wack and Big Pun, and I mean Wack and Fat Joe behind Big Pun. Uh, Fat Joe ain't never mentioned to me he got an issue with Pun or issue with nobody. And uh, you know, uh, as far as I'm concerned, he want to see Pun win and his family win. You know, the Fat Joe I know. So let's kill that narrative. Fat Joe's a friend of mine. Shit, he might be out here and Joe wrote a lot. He might be on motherfucking boat a lot. I run into him out here somewhere. But nevertheless, long story short, uh has <laughs> killed him there that Wax stood up to Fat Joe. Uh, shout out to Fat Joe, the whole KR K A R family, my nigga over there. You know, they know who I'm talking to. You know what I mean? It ain't that type of situation. Y'all kill that bullshit. I guess Charlie, Charlie Rock, Rock LD. That's what you're talking about. Charlie Rock LD. Yeah. Charlie Rock. Look, Charlie Rock salutes me for standing up to Fat Joe, right? So when I seen it, I had to correct him. Because I ain't I didn't have to stand up. I ain't stood up. What you mean stand up to Fat Joe? He had no conversation, no argument, no disputes, or no nothing about the big pun series. You know what I'm saying? So I ain't gonna make let a motherfucker think like it was a problem. If it is a problem, I don't know about it. Whatever he had going on with the white, that's what he had going on with the white. Ain't nobody called whack and question whack about his business. Wow. So for me to have to stand up to Fat Joe means I got a call or Fat Joe says something and I said, fuck that. I'm doing it anyway. No, none of that happened. The lady expressed that Fat Joe didn't block the shit a gang of times and whatever she came to me. I pushed the button, nigga, it made it happen. That's not Fat Joe. That's doing some big pawns family. Hey yo, whack. Hey yo, whack. You know, you 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 uh you know Cuban Link got really got cut because he was fucking uh pawn wife. You know that. I talk to Cuban leaks all the time. Yeah, that's know. what Joe said. He, he cut him because they, they cut him because uh, he was fucking on uh, Pong White. But salute to you, Wack. I never that heard that. I never heard that. But I, one thing about his wife, she is raw, uncut, and authentic. She's already touched bases on all that kind of shit. And his name never came up. Actually, I called Cuban Links while I had her up there with the chairman of the company doing the initial meeting. I had him on the FaceTime. And you can ping him in there and he'll tell you that. But I've never heard that. But nevertheless, I mean, I don't know what that is. I don't know why they um got to it. I never asked Cuban League why they got to it. But B, see that clip right there? I got Reek it ready. That. I got it ready. Reek said that, and that's why I did my thing on Instagram because I don't allow fake narratives, whether it makes me look good or bad. I don't want <laughs> narratives to be spun, bro. Some niggas that see a nigga put up a fake narrative and it make them look good and they just rock with it. 
Nah, I got I got to correct you. I didn't like like no, play no. that shit. Play that shit. <laughs> I got you. I got you back. Here we go. You already know who I be. The OGC Rock LD, original Tower Squad dude, you heard? And I want to take this time and send a crazy, crazy salute to WAC 100 for banging out for the Rio family. WAC 100, I salute you for not being scared of Fat Joe, doing what was the right thing to do. And it's crazy how the Rio family had to go all the way to L.A. for a dude to give her justice. You know what I mean? So again, salute to the homie, WAC 100, the OG Charlie Rock LD. I fucked with you. One. What up, my people? Yo. <laughs> Why they be talking on you like that, WAC? Hold on. Let me tell y'all how strong our room is. This is now you heard what you just said, right, Bullets? Yeah, 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 yeah. You heard what you just said. We're going to clear that up. Big plum yeah. wife in here somewhere listening. Nigga, look, she just texted me. You see that? PTR. That's why y'all got to stop running them narratives. Because one thing about her, she speak her truth. And that's why I fuck with her. Because she didn't told me some things that's not in her favor, nigga. And she told the writers the same shit. She kept it 100. I ain't going to speak on it. We're going to leave it with. She said. See what time? Now remember, where I'm at is 4:09 a.m. Where I'm at. Yeah, need receipts, man. You you see that right there, bro? Yeah. As soon as you nah, said nah, that. I see that. I see that. I yeah. see that. Let me I tell you that. what's crazy. She just texted me what she already told me. Who she really did sleep with? But I ain't gonna expose that yet. But it wasn't that nigga. She told me and everybody in the writer's cap who the fuck she slept with. And the shit she told me, most women, nigga, matter of fact, 100% of the women I know would have not said it. Facts. Yeah, that, that's that's crazy. Crazy. No, she told me she slept with, and we didn't even have to ask. She just said it, right? Who, 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 10 out of 10 no. women would not have said that out their mouth, bro. Yeah, that's crazy. It's just real shit, but see, you know, this is why I fuck with her because all she put it all on the table.